Ready? Yep. Okay, what I'm going to show you here is a trick that's useful for separating coaxial cables or for separating wires. Notice on this uh, coaxial cable, we have a braided shield. It's a thin braid of metal. And that braid totally encompasses the inside conductor. Now the problem is this, how do I take that braid off and use it as a separate conductor that I can put under a terminal and get that inner conductor out separately as well without making a mess of everything? I can unravel the braid if I want, but then everything gets frayed and messy very, very quick. So I need a very small screwdriver to do this. Great. I studied instrumentation with a group of Tibetan monks who showed me their secrets to uh, <laughs> stripping cables. Just kidding here. What I'm doing here is I am separating, carefully separating the strands towards the base of the shield. You see that? All I'm doing is I'm bending this here, taking a small screwdriver, an awl would work as well, and I'm carefully separating the strands. I'm not breaking anything, I'm not cutting anything, just carefully separating it. Then what I'm going to do is put the screwdriver under here and peel that out. Now watch what happens. I have not broken the braids at all, they aren't frayed. Isn't that a cool trick? Yeah, mm -hmm. it is. And if, what you can do at this point, you take a pair of wire uh, strippers and strip off the insulation off that. So now you have the center conductor exposed. You have the shield exposed. And if you want to seal up uh, the wires here so they're not free to touch anything or short out, you just get some heat shrink tubing and slip over that to get a heat gun, shrink it down, and now you've got two insulated wires coming out of a single coax cable. Is that cool, cool. or what? Yeah. yeah. All right. Looks a little cleaner than mine did. <laughs>